Well, I am so glad that you are joining us for week seven. When we started this, we really thought we'd only do a couple of weeks of trivia, and it's turned in now to seven weeks of trivia. I appreciate so many of you enjoying it, playing along, passing it on to other people, reading your Bibles. Um, while we're going through this last week, we did Old Testament stories, and so this week I thought we would move back to the New Testament so that we're moving around our Bibles. I hope you're getting comfortable doing that. So today, week seven, day one, we're going to talk about Jesus feeding the 5,000 and then walking on the water in Mark. We're going to be in the book of Mark today. So question number one, when Jesus saw the large crowd waiting, how did he feel? When Jesus saw the large crowd waiting, how did he feel? A, he was disappointed that they followed him. B, he thought it was funny. C, he had compassion for the people. D, he didn't care one way or the other. When Jesus saw the large crowd waiting, how did he feel? A, he was disappointed that they followed him. B, he thought it was funny. C, he had compassion for the people. Or D, he didn't care one way or the other. The correct answer is C. Jesus had compassion for the people who were waiting for them. Question number two. How much food did the disciples find? When Jesus told them to go see what you can find, how much food did the disciples find? A, five loaves of bread and two fish. B, lots of bread but no fish. C, one small loaf of bread and one small fish. Or D, they didn't find any food at all. How much food did the disciples find when Jesus told them to go look for food? Was it A, five loaves of bread and two fish? B, lots of fish, but I mean, lots of bread, but no fish. Lots of bread, but no fish. C, one small loaf of bread and one small fish. Or D, they didn't find any food at all. The correct answer is A, they found five loaves of bread and two fish. Question number three, how many baskets of food were left over after everyone had eaten? How many baskets of food were left over after everyone had eaten? A, seven, B, three, C, nothing was left, or D, 12. How many baskets of food were left over after everyone had eaten? A, seven, B, three, C, nothing was left, or D, 12. The correct answer is D, 12. After everyone had eaten their fill, there were 12 baskets of food left over. Question number four, what did Jesus do after he made the disciples get in the boat and leave and then he sent the crowd away. So Jesus took the disciples, he made them get in a boat and leave, he sent the crowd away. What did Jesus do? A, he went up a mountain to pray. B, he rested at a local home. C, he walked around the lake. Or D, he just sat down and enjoyed the quiet. What did Jesus do after he made the disciples get in a boat and go and he made the People go away. What did Jesus do? A, he went up a mountain to pray. B, he rested at a local home. C, he walked around the lake. Or D, he just sat down and enjoyed the quiet. The answer is A, Jesus went up a mountain to pray. As you're reading through your scripture when we're doing these trivia Questions, I hope you notice how many times Jesus does that. Jesus will remove himself from everyone and pray. A great example for all of us. Question number five. Who did the disciples think Jesus was when they saw him walking on the water? Who did they think he was when they saw Jesus walking on the water? A, they knew it was Jesus. B, 
they thought he was a ghost, C, they had no idea, or D, they didn't see him walking on the water. Who did the disciples think Jesus was when they saw him walking on the water? A, they knew it was Jesus. B, they thought he was a ghost. C, they had no idea. Or D, they didn't see him walking on the water. The correct answer is B, of course. They thought he was a ghost. Our scripture reference today is Mark 6, verses 30 to 56. Mark 6, verses 30 to 56. There are miracles all around us, even today. Do you see them? Do we see them and do we acknowledge them as miracles? I hope you'll watch for miracles. Something to think about.